I was asked to rank all the live action Spider-Man suits, so guess what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna rank all the live action Spider-Man suits from worst to best. And it's a ranking video, so you know there's gonna be some controversy, but guess what? There ain't shit you could do about it besides flex your thumbs in the comments, and this is the best Spider-Man suit list you're gonna see on TikTok. So let's get into it. I'm gonna start off with an honorable mention to the final suit, No Way Home. It has potential to be number one on this list, but we just haven't seen enough of it, but it definitely has that genre meta feel to it. In last place, I got the homemade suit from The Amazing Spider-Man. Bro, he just looks like the Hollow Man. It looks terrible like i could have made this suit next up we have the human spider first of all this pose looks like when you threw up and you went mom i just threw up but i'm not gonna lie to you if i didn't say it was tough when i was a kid next up just barely edging those out i have the stealth suit from far from home in theory an all black stealth suit would be fire right this one's just meh and this isn't even spider-man this is night monkey what is it even doing on this list from there i'm gonna go with the black and red suit turned inside out i remember when everyone freaked out about this was a symbiote suit like come on bro hey but peter's just like me for real because everyone knows that when one side of your underwear doesn't work you just flip and stop talking before y'all get federal in the comments next i got Andrew suit from the amazing spider-man one look I, I I'm, not, I'm not a fan of the gold eyes me personally I don't really like it it definitely looks like scuba Steve from there I'm gonna go with the iron spider suit and look the first time we all saw it freaked out infinity war sick ass scene right then it got old he just used it way too much and honestly I'm sick of it next up I got the integrated suit from no way home I like it I get it the gold is a little too much for me I hate it when they over design spider-man suits but I thought it was pretty dope that it was the iron spider suit with the black suit I thought that was a cool little way to introduce it and it does feel very iron man plus my niner fan so red and gold two thumbs up in sixth place i got the homemade suit from homecoming i just i love this suit so much it feels very ben riley obviously took inspiration from ben riley spider-man and this is easily the best homemade suit in any spider-man movie ever in fifth place i don't know why i did that i have the symbiote spider-man suit from spider-man 3 simple sleek ferocious vicious see it chump coming in at number four we have the red and black suit from far from home i love it i love red and black together i think the color design is sick sleek back and black. in third place i got the civil war suit that he eventually wore in homecoming i wish they would have kept this practical the entire time but i get it they gotta put a layer of cgi over but to me this is probably the best adapted version of the classic costume and i love how literally anyone can wear it just put on it and now here we go the top two in second place as much as it pains me to say I have Toby's suit from the original trilogy. And I'm really just gonna be lumping them all together. I know they made, I know the suits are different in each movie. They've made minor upgrades from the first movie to the second movie to the third movie, but this is it. The raised webbing, the triangular shaped eyes, and I love that they are not afraid to destroy the suit. To me, that just made the costume so much cooler and it's iconic, it's classic. But in first place, you know we gotta give it to the amazing Spider-Man suit too. The best Spider-Man gets the best costume. Tell me why you hate my ranking down in the comments below and tell me how you would rank them. And as always, like and follow for more.